hey what's going on guys we have this question right here it's asking determine all the values of p such that matrix 1 1 1 2 p p 2 2 1 is not invertible so in this case what we have to do is so first of all if it, if uh, if a matrix has to be invertible then it shouldn't be the determinant of it shouldn't be equal to zero so let's say this is a so if if, if it should be inver invertible then the determinant a shouldn't be equal to zero but in this case they are asking uh, find the matrix that such it's not invertible so so we have to find the data uh, matrix that's when we find that the determinant of a, a should be equal to zero Th that's the only situation this is going to be not invertible so first of all to find that one i had to find determinant so let's uh, let's do this one determinant so the the question is asking p so p value that will make the determinant a is equal to zero so let's see how we can calculate so since in this case let's I'm, I'm copying the matrix down it's going to be 1 1 1 2 p p 2 2 1 so if I put plus minus plus rate a it's going to be minus plus minus plus it's going to be plus minus minus plus so uh, to solve this solve this uh, for p it's a uh, better to take the second row so if I take the second row it's going to be so determinant of a is going to be equal to so we have to equalize to zero so this is let's say zero is equal to this one so negative two first if i take negative two i have to get rid of the vertical and horizontal component of this one so it's going to be one one so ad minus bc one one is going to be one and two one is going to be minus two so it's going to be one one minus two then the second one is going to be p so i take the p is positive so positive plus p and then if I take this one, I have to get rid of the vertical and horizontal component of this one. It's going to be 1 times AD minus BC is going to be 1 times 1 and minus 2 times 1. So it's going to be 1 minus 2. Then minus P. And if I take minus P right here, vertical and horizontal cancels, then it's going to be 1 times 2. Then minus. So this, if I take this one, this 2 will go. So 1 times 2 and 2 times 1 so it's going to be 2 minus 2 is going to be 0 anyway 2 minus 2 so then uh, then let's see so minus 2 minus 2 this is going to be minus 1 so minus 2 times minus 1 is going to be plus 2 plus p uh, times this is going to be 1 minus 2 is going to be minus 1 so minus p equal to 0 therefore we know minus p is equal to minus 2 therefore p is equal to 2 so this is the value uh, in which the determinant of a will be equal to zero therefore when p is two in these two columns this uh, matrix become not invertible so this is my final answer i hope you guys like this video see you next time